everyone and welcome back to my channel today i am so excited to share with you guys some christmas tree decorating tips also today is day four of my 12 days of christmas series that i am doing for this season to inspire you to get ready for christmas and this series will run through the month of november so please watch this video to the end to hear the giveaway information and if you miss any of the previous videos i will leave a link of the 12 days of christmas series down in the description box and if you are new here welcome my name is antoinette i love to share my passion for diy and decor and mostly holiday styling so if you are interested in things like that please consider subscribing and hit the notification bell to be notified whenever i upload my new videos last year i purchased these two flocked christmas tree from walmart canada and we loved how they turned out i will link that video down in the description box for you in case you want to check it out i already put one christmas tree up in our bedroom and that one is a traditional colors of red white and some sparkly silver also that video will be linked down in the description box so today i am going to show you how to decorate these trees using same steps that i used on the previous one but these trees color scheme is going to be pink with champagne and some shimmery gold colors After I put my trees up, I like to lay out all the decorations that I will be using on my trees. Then I divide them into two equal groups. So I'm gonna start decorating one tree first, then I'm gonna decorate the other one exactly the same way. So before adding any decorations to the tree, I like to go through and fluff all the branches. And as you can see, I already went through and fluffed them all. The next step would be adding the lights and these trees are pre-lit but if yours is not pre-lit then this is the time to add the lights. Next thing I like to do is adding the ribbons and these pretty ribbons were from Michaels a few years ago. I got them on clearance after Christmas. In last video I showed you guys the technique of how I layered two ribbons but today I am going to use another technique that I really love it's the tuck and twist method and for this method I like to cut my ribbons about one yard and you can still layer your ribbons but I am gonna work with one ribbon when it comes to decorating a Christmas tree, it's nice to place your decorations either like a diamond shape or like a zigzag this tree is only six and a half feet tall so i'm gonna do mine zigzag i start placing decorations from the top moving diagonally all the way down so first i'm gonna tuck the ribbon in the tree like this then twist it tuck and twist then i'm gonna repeat same thing on the other side again diagonally tuck and twist Once I'm done with adding the ribbons, I add the florals and the pecs. I love these pink poinsettia flowers. They were from Michaels few years ago. I have been using them in my Christmas trees for the last three years. Absolutely gorgeous. It's so hard not to include them in my Christmas decor. So I'm just going to place them on the tree diagonally as well. Florals are great to add to the tree, especially to cover any big gaps between the branches. Also, I love adding picks for different texture and these were also from Michaels. Next step is adding the ornaments. I will be putting the large size ornaments in first and I am going to place them inside the tree like this. And the next ornaments would be the medium size ornaments and these I am going to place them a little bit out of the tree. Then I'm gonna go ahead and add the different shape ornaments along with the small ones to create layers and dimension.
I love these sparkly wings. They were from Dollar Tree last year. A good friend of mine here on YouTube told me that adding at least one bird to the tree gives that person good luck. So I picked up this cute bird and this crystal ornament from HomeSense this year. Also these gorgeous crystal ornaments were from HomeSense. And these sparkly ones I had for a long time. I'm just going to add these more to the tip of the branches. Last step is adding the topper. And I'm going to use these sparkly pegs that I already had. And I am just going to stick them straight on the top of the tree like this. To elevate the tree and to add texture. I'm going to play around with and step down and take a look at it and make sure I like how it looks. And once I was happy with the look, I added this little swan and I thought it looked so cute. Also, don't forget to add to the bottom of the tree. This year, I decided to add a skirt and this one I had from HomeSense. So here is the final look of both Christmas trees all decorated. I absolutely love how pretty they turned out. I hope you guys find these tips helpful. And if you did, please give this video a thumbs up and let me know what you think. So this season, as appreciation for my viewers, I decided to give away a $100 gift card to Amazon. And all you need to do is watch all the videos of 12 Days of Christmas, like them, and comment on all the videos. The winner will be picked and announced on November 30th on my community tab and also on my Instagram stories.
thank you so much for joining me and supporting me and my channel don't forget to like this video and leave a comment so you will be entered the giveaway i hope to see you guys on my next one until then be well and have fun